finally decided now's the time and bought myself a GTR always 32 I've never even considered 33s or 34s obviously 34s are very expensive but even if I had the money this would be the choice Very straight car. It's just beautiful. Didn't originally like these Nismo rims, but they've grown on me a lot in the last couple of weeks. I bought it about two weeks ago. Got a Z Sport. I'll show you. Z Sport Dash, uh, Z, sorry, Z Sport Speedo, which I, uh, I know is not standard, um, and that's 320. Um, nearly gone, nearly gone through a whole tank, and I'm only at 322 k's. This tank, I'm just wondering um, whether it's the standard Speedo setup, just with the, um, I think it's from a. Um, 350Z, the Z Sport um, Speedo, so I thought maybe if it's just a, a converter um, that converts it, similar to the ones that convert from kilometres an hour to miles, miles an hour, um, if it was just one of them that converted it to three, up to 320, um, and if so, maybe that counter is wrong, so maybe that's why it appears to have such bad economy, but I haven't haven't had a look yet. It's all these uh show you this side. Not peeling. Every single R32 one peels. Also they've all got a bubble here. Perfect. Bubble here? No. Just it's been very well looked after. It's got a HKS boost gauge. HK suspension all round. And oil pressure when when it's warm, I know this is an 89 and I know that 89's had trouble with oil pressure but um, I've had this running obviously it's at, well it's nearly at running temperature um, when it gets right up there the oil pressure drops right back and I have got a very thin oil in it, I can't actually remember what I put in it right now but um, hoping that that's not too much of an issue Can, it is creeping up if you can see that but it's still only just above zero the, um, the oil pressure lights not on so I'm hoping that means something and I've got enough oil in there um, big four inch tip it's pretty quiet though which is good the non-standard white indicators it's about the only dent I can find on the car, if you can see it in the video. There's... Just... There. Other than that, it's just so straight. So perfect. And, uh... Bit of character. It's got this... Japanese writing in number two. I'm not sure whether that's from a track day or something in Japan. Someone probably had a bit of fun with it before they got rid of it. Uh, rear tail light surrounds. I've got two perfect ones in the boot, but you can see the clear coats peeling off a bit there. I just haven't gotten around to putting them back on. Um, what else? Oh, 
um, two wheel drive, four wheel drive switch and uh, four wheel drive controller settings 1 through to 10 adjusts the accelerometers in the Tesla system and yeah that's my GTR